Hi, this is me Tasha Copeland and today I'm going to be showing you my April makeup haul so far. So this is during the first, um, I guess the first 15 days of uh, May and this is what I've already gotten so far and not done. More makeup is coming in and get ready to order some more and then I'll probably be done for a little bit. So I end up going through Makeup Revolution and I picked up this little pretty palette. I love pink as you guys know. Let's see here. Alright, so I want to make it hard to open. There we go. So as you see it comes with this little brush. Will not be using it. Those things really never last too long anyways. So these are the ones that come in it. I'm not going to too much swatch them. I'm going to show you the color. So let's see here. Yeah, let me swatch the purple. I just don't want to put my hands all good so I know I'm not going to really use them. So, I've already been swatching other colors. So, it's not that great. That's the one thing I'm learning about the pink palettes with them. Even with the candy um, collection, the candy bar collection. Is that the pink ones, the colors are not that fabulous at all. But I do like this one, and right now the site is um, down because they are revamping it. And so this is the name of this one, and it's called Unicorn Love. So it's by Revolution Makeup, or Makeup Revolution. So. Isn't that just too cute? Look at that. Yeah, that's just too cute. So, end up going for this little candy bar as you see I love pink as I said before alright so another one of these little brushes I'm glad they come in because a lot of people don't have makeup brushes so they wouldn't have a way to apply these so that does come in helpful since you can get like real makeup brushes but so let me swatch this purple one see what that one does yeah, the colors are not that great. Like I said, especially with the pink palettes. Let me see, I'm going to swatch one more. Let's go here with the highlighter. Yeah, you have to do a lot just to get something. Yeah. I'm just doing the collection. I'm not doing it for the makeup because if I just did it for that without doing the collection, I wouldn't be buying it. The colors are not great. Okay, so ended up with this one. Let some of you know I have the um the gold one. So this is another black palette. Let's see. All right, the pink one is called um, Chocolate Love, which should have been on this label since this is chocolate, and this one's called Chocolate Vice. Let me show you the colors in this one. Yeah, I don't like having to pop something like that. I feel like I'm going to break it. Oh, Doug Gunny. Me and my freaking nails. Just dug right through it. You see that? Look at that. Oh, let's watch it. Yeah, not that great. Yeah, the color payoff is not. It's better than the pink ones to me because I like dark colors. But at the same time like what the hell maybe they revamping the formula that's why the site is down that black one it, it stands out see that these little other ones they're not that strong to me in color so I'm trying to see if I can find the other one so I can show you this the difference but that one seems to have disappeared <laughs> Right, maybe it's over here. So then went on to BH Cosmetic. Now I'm not doing these in the exact orders that I ordered them from. So I may end up going back to Makeup Revolution. And then um, City of Colors, back and forth. Was this one the Pride and Prejudice from the movie? I think it premiered um, last year, I think it was. Or the year before last. So these had sold out. And um, they, was, they got them back in. And what they did was a clearance on them. So these 
last time I saw yesterday, which was um, Wednesday, so that would make it the 10th, they still had a lot of those left. So, these are the colors. You see that? Very pretty. Let's see what this shade is called. I can't make that out. So. Look at that. Those are so pretty to me. I'm going to have a good time rocking these. Well, I did try the pink one, cause so I was like, I can't, n I can't keep giving Jesse all my pink uh, shades. I'm gonna have to learn how to wear this. And surprisingly, when I put it on, it was so pretty on my skin. Let me show you. You see that? And it's like a dark purplish pink, so I knew then I could rock that very well so then we have the other two colors so this one's more like a pecan nude you see that very pretty I like this, this one also and then we have this last one which is like a Pepmo Bismo pink that. But it's still very pretty. And I love me some pink. Okay, so while I was there, as I said, they had the um they had brought it back. So not just lip gloss, but also the, the palette. Oh yeah, I just had to have it. Sorry about that. I waited for months for this palette to come back in order now this one is sold out now I've asked them if they get it back in to give me notification because I want to use this one and I want to save the other one so I've already uh, put in the order for some more um, lip gloss so that I can wear the ones I've already tried on and just save the other one so you see that color pale for the black this one here so let's wash this um, gold one. Look at that. Now that was, that's one thing. I was, if you notice with BH Cosmetics, they stuff is jumping off. One swipe, that's what you get. It's like a buttery um, feel. There's no fallout as you can see. I just have to advocate them. I love their products. It's pigmentation there. It's not weak. You don't have to go for several swipes just to get a color payoff. So I'm loving this. So the um, Pride and Prejudice Zombie Palette. Isn't it just so cute? So then I went ahead because I had been looking at this for a while. And I decided on this color because I wanted to get the pink one but I was like I'm doing too much in pink. Let's just say that these colors are really great. Let me show you the purple one. Now I'm trying to order another one of these too. So I like to have backups to the backup. You see that? You see how pretty that is? Alright, let's go for this one. Look at that. The color payoff is fabulous. Let's go in for this one. Look at that, that blue one. Gorge. Look at the colors, they're just so pretty. And this one is called uh, um, Wild and Free. And it's a baked shot, um, um, eyeshadow palette. But you see how great those colors are? This is like so pretty. So while I was there at Beach Cosmetics, I picked up this. And this is the uh, Black Light Highlighter. Cause I'm learning to use blush now because I keep getting them. It's, I, I'm not ordering them like I did this one on purpose. They come free for some things that you order. So I decided I'll go ahead and try this out. So this is all the rave. Now the one thing I'm going to say is that for some of these, I've seen that other people's got theirs within 
three to five days with regular shipping the free shipping some of my stuff took over a week to come in that right there almost had me to the point that I did not want to order from them ever again I don't like stuff like that so these are the um what does it get the highlights so let's try this blue one let's see here kind of subtle all right let's go with Electra this, this one right here yeah that is great all right let's try the pink one and this one is called on point now here this one is supposed to be the best you see that you see how pretty that is So I'm going to have to test these to see if they glow in the dark like some of the other palettes that are saying the same thing. So this is the black, black light highlighter palette. Six colors. I just love this one so much. I like it. So this is like the first blush set that I actually ordered on purpose. It said it had been sent to me for free. So I just thought I'd tell you something. So... I too got the Carly palette. I waited to the second day that it was in order for pre-order, so I did have to wait for it to, um, you know, basically come and then be sent. So you're on the waiting list. So my mine's was the second day. I went the second day after seeing it, and I started not to, but then I was like, don't be stupid. Try this palette out. Try to see what you know how her makeup is. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna give it a shot. So this too came when the black light one came. So all of my orders did not come at at different times. They came at the same time, which meant that I had to wait for this here to start being shipped out in order to get the rest of my order. But this here also, I did learn from other people that were um, on the list with me by the second or third day. Like I said, they got theirs within three to five days. I got mine last Saturday and I'm just now previewing because I was so pissed and I knew I would be pissed when I talked about it because I didn't like the fact that it took longer for me to get mine. So I'm not going to swash this because I, I'm just using it as a collector's item. Did you see the colors here? So it came with, I want to see, 15. Um, eyeshadows two highlighters and four, four um, blushes this is a beautiful palette I'm liking the way that the colors are coming through so this is her collection as you know she's on YouTube and this is the um, deluxe edition now this here I'm about to tell you guys something so listen deep this ran $19 and some change on BH Cosmetics. Now, on Ultra, Ulta, I mean, it is going for $16. If you want to save $3, go to Ultra. Ulta. I don't know why I keep saying the name wrong. Ulta. It is cheaper. I wish I had known that before I got it from BH Cosmetics. And then I would have waited a little longer just to go ahead and get it off the other site and save myself $3. But you never know until you have done. Then you find out later. So what a, if I could have, should have, too late. But I'm glad I ordered it in, anyways. And right now they got it on the site. So they got plenty of them on the site from what I've seen. And they're still selling them at $19. Like, $19 is some change. Like why would you allow a different site to sell your products and sell it cheaper than what you're selling on your own site buying off the site itself is supposed to be cheaper within itself but in this case it really isn't so i have been looking at this one for the longest which is the um sixth edition this was their last um one that they put out re um the last time so i've been watching it it was staying kind of sold out for a while and so when they got it back in order i was on that list so, and these are colors. 
and this one comes with 120 colors as well now this is supposed to be a um, birthday edition I do believe so as you see more colors underneath that so these are like really pretty and because I've ordered this just to have it like a collection thing I will not be swatching it once you start putting your human hands all that grease and oils and everything start breaking down things very fast so I will not be touching this but as you see the colors are very pretty and as I said this is the sixth edition now this one is currently on sale on their site for um, I think it is um, $16 but I got this one for $9.99 so it was on it was even true because I had a coupon code and it's not usable now. They change it up every other day or you know. So just go to retailmenot.com and if we don't see the sale on BH Cosmetic itself, Retail Me Not will have the um, codes there. In fact they have more codes there than BH Cosmetics got because there are other things BH Cosmetic is doing that it's not listed on the site. Okay. So, for me ordering from them and ordering um, over $30 worth of merchandise, they sent this here. I've shown this to you guys before. So, just a little lipstick uh, palette. You know, the nude lips to go. So, yeah. Probably be giving that to someone because I already have one. So, then um, for Makeup Revolution, I ordered this here. As you see. And this is the triple bait bronzer. I've worn this twice. And it looks this seriously like I've been kissed by the California sun. And I was born in California. So let's see here. I want you guys to see how great. Because I always do it like this. I don't individually do it. You see that? You see that? So if I individually swash them. Taking the top one here. That's that one. You see that? This one is my favorite out of all three of the colors. Look at that. Now, like I said, this is on Makeup Revolution, but the site is down for reconstruction. So they're sending you to um, Ulta to, in order to order their stuff. There's a link there on their site that pushes you through to Ulta. And Ulta, this here on the site itself was like um, $7.99 is what I paid for it. I think it was from $7 to $7.99. On Ulta itself, the website that they're sending you to until they come back up themselves, the American um, website, is they're selling these for, I, I do believe I saw it for, on sale for $5.99 or $6. Now, I want to wait until the site is up itself because I have coupon codes to um makeup revolution which i will do my best to list here if i don't just you know dm me and i'll give you the code because the codes are good forever or until they decide to stop using them so there's no expiration date on them but i want to get me some more so i'm loving these here so these is what they sent to me for free for buying their products and these are the hand therapy so I'm gonna try these and let you guys know how it works. I tried the the laughing line one mask. Yeah, no. Uh, I, it might work for somebody else, but it just didn't hit me at all. So then I went to City uh, um, Color and I got this here. And these two came as a pack. So I want you to notice how small they are. Because on the site, they're going to look like big palettes like the ones for BH Cosmetic. These are not used. These are travel size, basically. But you can put in your purse and go. And I like it. But at the same time, I thought they were going to be big palettes like the one on BH Cosmetic. Thank God that I read reviews before I order something. Or else I would have been highly disappointed when it's came in at this size but then again like i said both of them it was, as a set was 9.99 so you can't beat that 
So let me show you the colors because I those were the colors that you seen me had on my arms earlier because I was already swatching them. So let me get it open. Lord have mercy, I can't get into it now. There we go. So it does come with a little sponge one. So let's see. Let's go with this pink one here. So as you see, it's not that bright. That's why it wasn't that bright when I swatched it on the arms earlier. So I said for $9.99. That's not too bad. It's not like beige cosmetics, see that? So I'm swatching this new one here. So let's try to do it again. Yeah, like on the hand, you see how bright it is? But by the time you apply it to your skin, 